have our connect you and we are going to get the fruits from here we'll be uh, doing also the what you call puli puli is that food uh, there are some kids they are born or even our kids are like a uh, one year seven months they cannot be able to eat the apple so what you are going to use to uh, to do is you are going to have that puli is is mashed yeah. what do you call it and is that a cup paste yeah like a tomato paste we will have that apple as in that and it has been a lot uh, people have been asking even for the the airline because airline they, they handle a lot of kids so that one will also do and then we we'll do the concentrates concentrates there are people who are making apple juice but they're also importing uh the concentrates we don't want to do juice for now because those one the, the, the three products are way far way far i mean it will take almost the, the apples, but for those people who want to, to do the juices, we'll be selling the concentrates as far as even Uganda. The hotels, big hotels, they buy, they import the, the concentrate to make juice. So those ones, they will help uh, even the, the post-harvest uh, management will be able to handle that. Because uh, when you are slicing, you see not everything will go to the, to the apple crisps. So there's this part on the top and the so that one will not throw it away there are those apples that have been eaten by the birds they are halfway or quarterly there are those apples that have fallen down like a week there's nothing you throw those are the ones that you're going to use uh uh i uh, mean the concentrate because the uh the concentrate the honest uh we are only selling to you the time so the more it a lot the more variable it is so you can imagine like tomatoes, the way you throw the biggest number is the one you live in the farm. So for the apples, we'll be making those uh, concentrate. So the farmer will not lose. Even those tiny fruits will just come and do them. So the, 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 the price will be always a uh, premium. Whether the, the grade one, the grade two, or even those small, or even the ones that are falling down. So that's how we beauty with the apples that you will be. So I think up to that moment, I think the, the, the mind of the... The market should should not worry you at all yeah. at all. So the management of Wambugo apples is one. As I said, even the mangoes, you need to be managing with water and manure. And you can go as far as have, having a rabbit and uh, correcting the urine. The urine is very good, and as a pesticide and also as a foria, very good. The white flies will not come closer where you have sprayed uh, rabbit urine. The chiri, chiri, neem oil, and ginger are very good. Uh, also to control the powdery medium very powerful so you can use those as a uh, organic uh, a, organic uh, yes so they are very good they just made the chili you get the chili the hot chili don't buy the one with the i mean the powder one just go to the farm and get if you don't have it please these are some of the things you need to plant them plant them randomly or strategically even them being in the farm they are pests that cannot come closer to your plants for having those chili. And you get the, 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 the hot one, like the African badai chili is also oh, good. Mm -hmm. So those are the chilies that you have. The small one. Not yeah, the, yeah, small yeah, the small one. Small. Yeah. The because small one, yes. Yeah. That one is mm. very, very hot. Mm. So you just pick the red one. Yeah. Now, which, which name do I use? You smash it. Smash. Yeah. Yes, smash? Yes. Then put in water, yeah. allow it to be there at maybe two or one or two nights okay. for it for that to ferment to, to remove all the mm. the hotness. Mm. So then at uh, the third day you sieve it. Mm -hmm. You of course you remove it with a what do you call it? Sieve. The sieve, yeah. yeah. So that you are you have you are left with the just water. Yes, water. You put in the pump so that the you pump. don't also uh, damage Spray your palm yeah. and then start start spraying everything even the the, the what do you call it the skuma or what do you call them skuma yeah, skuma skuma yeah. <laughs> <laughs> i'm saying no, no, i, I like must start invention. talking kenyan stamps and <laughs> but of course we share the we share the name yeah. so you just bring that one the white fries the the catworm you see the catworms that cuts mm. um you are they will not be there another thing uh is uh what you do you call it garlic? sorry Garlic, garlic, uh, hot chili, ginger, and neem oil. That one is for uh, powdery meat. You, some, yeah, you see some, some, a small cabranch white having some whitish. Yes. Mm. You know that one cannot flower, even if heaven and earth come together, they will not. So that branch, you first cut it off, cut, completely, just cut it off, and make sure you 
dip it, you make a hole and yes, because that one is is a what do you call it? I'm lacking the name. I know it in mother tongue. That's the problem of English. You can use it. Sorry? It's bango. Yes, good. Fango. That's a fango infection. So you just pull it and put it down there and cover it up. So just cut it, even if it's a whole branch. Cut it, it, it and put it. It plant look white or what? what is it? Powder and medium. Oh, it's just a powdery thing. Yes, yes. yes. Show something like powder. Yeah, it's very white common, powder. especially. Powder. Yeah. Okay. So that one cut, then you spray the rest of the branches not to be affected. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, even mangoes. Yeah, they are very common. Yeah. So that one, you, you mix neem oil, ginger, garlic, and uh, hot chili. is a very good. Because some of these exercises are very good. Yeah, they will save you even your your money instead of and also, First, I mean, neem oil. Or can I use neem leaves? Yeah, you can use neem leaves. No, you, you can use, but also the oil it is, is good. Eh? It's oh, also it's, 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 it's also stronger. soothes the leaves. Okay. It soothes. It's like now you tell me to do what? Which oil is that? Uh, I don't know which to use. But when I apply the 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 jelly, it's, it's, it's different. Yes. Than than using the leaves. Sesame. Sorry. If you're using sesame, seems Yes, yes. Yeah. You do, by the time that your skin. So, but this one is already the final product. So it soothes the leaves and then appreciate the the the, the chili to go in. Mm. So that the the whatever the 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 fungo will just clear because even the leaves and also it, it works like um sticker. You know, oh, even if it yeah, rains. Okay. The, ma the water will just, just go off. Would, mm. yeah. So it also helps to to sustain there. Mm. Even if the rain is there, it's just running. It's ask also as a very good sticker. So those are the <laughs> things too. But uh, I would say that uh, uh, make sure that you are doing manure now and then, and manure that you're using must be well decomposed. This is where some of these things are very 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 simple, but they are very important. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you. You know we are used to teachers, doctors. If you don't use those terminologies, you not become a good professor. <laughs> Here in farming, there are simple, simple things, but you, you shine. So, the, I mean, the manure should be well decomposed. Put your manure in a heap, put it there like a 30 or 60 days. Yes, cover them with a maybe plastic and sprinkle some water. Because let's not be, uh, those are, we are, it's like we are doing emergency. When you plant a tree, just make it in your mind. This is, it's like a marriage. Only death can do you part. <laughs> so you have to be prepared always. Mm. If you know that you are, you are applying manure on June next year, yeah. or let's say December, start looking for the manure now. If you're buying from neighbors, buy now, so that you are 100% sure that whatever you are applying there is well decomposed. Because if you collect down the manure from the cow house and put it here, this tree will consume that or will be able to eat that food until three months. So you're only lying to yourself that you have applied the manure. The other thing, the chances of burning and killing that tree are very, very high. Because the, that, that manure will go start decomposing to the roots. So in the process of decomposing, it's, there is a heat that they produces. So that it will always burn the roots and then you, you can even see a whole tree like this one dying off. Especially the, the small the small plants. If you're not sure of the manure you're using, forget about it. Just plant with a, without manure mm. as you decompose your manure. Decompose. Then later on, you can add. Mm. This tree is surviving even without Tony putting the manure. But when you put manure, the tree will just thicken. Yeah. There is no hurry in Africa, especially in Uganda mm -hmm. and Kenya. <laughs> so just take your time and be sure of what you're applying. And then from there, Watering must be very regular. It should not have a lot of water. That one will bring a lot of issues. The root rotting, the I mean the water log, and the, the leaves will start turning yellow. Mm. 